hey guys welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be a tutorial on how i got this bomb curly unit i did this crochet method and i did it in about an hour so if you guys want to see how i achieved this then definitely keep on watching but before you go you already know why because i say this in every video make sure you guys thumbs up this video hit that subscribe button and until next time as always bye guys all right guys so let's go ahead and get into it these are the products you'll need i will leave them down below so what i'm doing is just pinning my cap down to my dome head so what i like to do is take the needle through the cap link the hair to and pull it through twice so i double knot it And I'm doing it again. I hope you guys can see. So I open the needle up, put it through the cap, connect the hair through, close the needle up, pull it through the cap, and then I knot it twice. So the pretty much the majority of the back of this unit will have mainly ringlet wand curls. I love how natural these curls look and what I'm doing is I'm pretty much spacing out how I put these curls into this cap I wanted it to look really full but not too full I still want it to look as natural as possible and what I'm doing right now is I'm starting on the side so I started from the back and got about halfway through not really halfway but just a little bit through and then I start on the side and I space it out as well on the side as well too as you can see and again doing the same thing Pushing it through, closing it up, pulling it through, double knotting it. This literally took me about an hour to make. So I'm just going back in, doing the same thing again. Now working on to the next side. And I messed up on this one, so I'm gonna go back in and do it again. Let me know down below if you guys have tried this style out. Because I'm always down for a protective style. So I'm pretty much done with the back and the sides. So although my cap was a closure cap, it's okay. We're going to make this work. So... Towards the front, this is when I started using, going pretty much a pattern of the ringlet wand and the fluffy wand. And I'm just gonna go across because I do wanna bang instead of the middle parting. So right here, I'm doing ringlet wand, fluffy wand, ringlet wand, fluffy wand. And I'm doing that all the way up until I get ready to close it up. Now, I will tell you, with the fluffy one, it's really pretty, but the ends are a little bit too defined to me, so I end up having to cut the end so it can blend in with the ringlet one here. So, 
So now, like I said before, I did space it out on the sides and from the bottom up, once I got to the middle, getting ready to close it up, I did get a little bit closer with me applying, putting in this hair. And I know it's a little frizzy, but we're gonna make it work. I promise you we will. And here is our unit. So I'm just showing you guys, it does come with three cones, two at the front and one in the back. This is a lot of hair, but it's okay. We're gonna make it work. I promise this, we're gonna make it work. So I'm just gonna go in and I'm going to shape it up. And like I stated, I did want a bang. I think it's cute. <laughs> you guys let me know what you what you think. <laughs> hey girl. So now I'm going with my Nairobi foam lotion and I'm just going to pretty much give those curls a little bit more definition. Absolutely love how this turned out. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, if you guys have any questions, leave them down below. Make sure you guys thumbs up this video and hit that subscribe button. And until next time, bye guys.